an idea to be expressed needs emotion. And in order to express your emotion, you need an idea. I mean, that's the way I see music. <laughs> age of five, I, I decided that I wanted to be a musician. Of course, the main source of inspiration was my father. My father is a, a violinist. When he noticed that we were really firm and stoic with the idea that we wanted to become a musician, then he, he got us a private teacher, and that was the end of playing with our friends. There was a really good commercial of a great saxophone player from Cuba that was part of the, the famous band Iraqueres. The sound was the thing that uh, attracted my attention. Since then, I, you know, saxophone became my passion. You know, that it was just like a random thing by a TV commercial. I think my first composition must have been when I was like 13 years old. I think it always starts in a way in which you try to express yourself. You're trying to say things differently. Even when I'm composing things for the saxophone, which is my main instrument, I compose it in the piano. I never use my saxophone to compose. It's natural to go to the piano. I'm always thinking more in, uh, in, in the orchestration way. It gives you a whole different dimension, you know? Like the saxophone, it just it can also only play one, one note at a time. It cannot play chords or, or give you all these different colors and textures that the piano can give you. Cuba became a very special place for music uh, for two different reasons. Uh, the first one being the confluence of uh, two different cultures the African culture and the European culture. They really embrace everything that comes to them and then they turn it back as Cuban. Jazz arrive in Cuba and then you have Jazz Cubano. At this point in my life, the saxophone, I believe it became an, an extension of who I am, an extension of my body, so it's easy for me to think and hear the instrument already. I can speak through the instrument. I can hear my voice within that. It has a power for communication, you know? It has a power also for captivating people, you know? The saxophone and the saxophone player, because I always say that it's not the, the arrow, it's the Indian, it has this power of magic, and this magic and power that can really captivate people's attention, move people, you know? And it really help people communicate with a different language.